Ocean's Eleven, dude. Ocean's Eleven. What? Oh, this is a side quest too. Also, welcome back to Mass Effect. Well, no, uh, not exactly. But he wants to meet with me. I think he's going to kill me. Hey there. Oh, you're not CSEC, are you? Did you want some? I overheard you, you mole. What were you trying to explain to the officer before? My colleague is trying to kill me, and I thought we were friends. That's a serious coin. How do you know he wants you dead? He's changed. He won't talk to me at work anymore, and he started following me. Yesterday, he followed me all the way home, just waiting for a chance. I don't care what anyone thinks. He wants me gone. I know it. How can I help? Is there something I can do? Uh, talk to your friend, maybe? Would you? That's all I want. Someone to talk to him. Tell him to leave me alone. He thinks he can just push me around, but you'll show him, won't you? I'll talk to him. Just tell me where he is and I'll go find him. Yeah, Commander Shepard. Oh, right. Well, he wanted to meet with me down in the wards near the markets. He said he just wanted to talk, but I know better. His name's Shorban. He's a Salarian. You shouldn't have any trouble. He's just a scientist. Shorban? That's the guy who asked us to scan the Keepers. The Keepers? Well, even more reason to go after him. That's against regulations. I better look into this right away. Find out what he's up to. Anything's possible with Shorban these days. Well, good luck. All right. Well, I was looking for the requisition officer. I thought he was in one of these offices. But apparently I was wrong. What's this? Hard decryption? Don't mind if I do. Eh, crud, I pressed the wrong button. Helena Blake. There's no hard evidence against her, but if reports are correct, she's a powerful criminal element. Hmm. Must be another side quest that I triggered. I don't know. I thought he was right here. Maybe it's a different computer. But yeah, I got these other guys with me right now. Um, I maxed out their skills. Well, I didn't max them out. I. Oh, hey. We never scanned this guy. Plus 31 experience for that one. I guess maybe because we're further along in the story or something. But yeah, I got Caden and Garrus here, and I increased their skills because we haven't been using them, so they had some leftover points. So I just allocated them as I saw fit. But somewhere in this CSEC area... It can't be in there. Here he is. I found him. One sec. Looking you up. Hello, Commander. Show me what you got. Show me Sounds what you're working good. with. Just let me set you up. Oh, this must be a mistake. System's telling me to offer you our select stock. Spectre. Well, I... Heard about that, but I didn't realize it was you. Sorry, Commander. Just show me what you've got. I'll open the rare stocks for you, Commander. Enjoy. Whoa, that's a lot of money. That's some good stuff, though. I wonder how good the shops actually are, or if you just find stuff as you go. Grenade upgrade, though. And then we can get the license for this shop. The rest of it is way out of our price range. 
don't we feel like gutter trash? Let's sell all our junk. I marked a few things as junk. Yeah. Got some money for that. Okay, well, that's what I came back here for, was to see that requisition officer. I forgot he was just a shop. So, now we gotta do that Jaleed and Chorbin thing. So we gotta go to the markets and find Chorbin. Or Shorbin, whatever his name is. I think he's in the downstairs bit. How you guys doing anyway? It's still my birthday, and I fell asleep. I took a nap. So now I don't really feel like going out like I was planning on. Oh, there he is. Commander, I wasn't expecting to see you again. Is there something you want? You can start by telling me the truth, Shorbin. I'm not sure what you're referring to. My experiments are... We're not buying it. Jaleed told us you've been after him. You... Spoke with Jaleed? Then you know about the data? No, but you're gonna tell me. Everything. You boys can go. Looks like my plans have changed. It's not as bad as you think, Commander. Jaleed and I just got a little... over our heads. Keep talking. The company we work for developed an experimental procedure for use in medical scanners. Jaleed and I saw even more potential. So we stole the plans and secretly developed a tool to scan the Keepers. Can you imagine? A tool that can actually get readings from the Keepers? What's so special about that? The Keepers are almost impossible to scan. And you can't capture them or get samples. They just self-destruct. After centuries here, we still don't know anything about them. Don't you see? We were the first to scan them, ever. You've seen it yourself, Commander. You know we can do it. Why are you trying to kill your partner? I'm not trying to kill him. Jaleed's job was to disseminate our initial findings. But he decided to keep the data for himself. Maybe to sell it. I don't know. So you're just trying to get back what Jaleed already stole? We lost our heads. We just couldn't let an opportunity like this pass us by. Commander, if you'll just continue gathering data for me, imagine what we might learn. And you'll stand to make a bit of a profit yourself, remember? I suppose a little scanning here and there won't hurt anyone. Very good. Maybe if you wouldn't mind speaking with Jaleed. The data you're gathering for me is useless if Jaleed won't help me analyze it. I'll go have a chat with him right now. Thank you. And happy scanning, Commander. Alright, so Jaleed was pulling the wool over our eyes. Now we gotta go check in with him again. So we'll just go back to that fast travel point. And he was in the CSEC Academy. I'm starting to get a feel for this map a little bit. Maybe I will still go out. It really all depends. Hello again. Did you have any luck finding Shorbin? I found out you've been lying to me, Jaleed. Lying? Why would I lie to you? You forgot to mention the data about the Keeper. Uh, he told you? I didn't mean for any of this to happen. I was afraid Shorbin would kill me to get the data, so I... Well, I was hoping you'd take care of him. I'm scanning the Keepers for Shorbin, but you two need to stop fighting. You're... You're helping us? But... Well, if you say so. Well, if Shorbin can forgive and forget, then so can I. I appreciate the help, Commander. I better go get that data analyzed. 
Eh, 317 experience, that's not bad. Alright, I think that's about it. There's probably more side quests here in the Citadel somewhere. I don't know how to trigger them, though. So, let's go back to the docking bay. In breaking news, Chairman Burns of the Parliament Subcommittee on Transhuman Studies has been kidnapped by biotic extremists. The biotics commandeered a freighter and were last seen in the Hades... Yeah, whatever. That, that was probably a quest, too, that it was talking about. Stand by, shore party. Decontamination in progress. Logged. The commanding officer is aboard. Exo Presley stands relieved. Alright, so we need the galaxy map. And we have to... Go to one of the three locations that the main quest was talking about. So let's back out of the citadel. And yeah, there's. We did the Exodus cluster. There's Novaria. Liera is what I'm thinking we'll do. Hades Gamma. That's where I was just talking about. But yeah, let's go to Liera's dig site. Oh, it's not marked further. So there's four galaxies we can explore. Can't skip this. I guess we're gonna just have to trial and error it and see which of these galaxies is where the lady's hiding or being captured, I guess. There's no marker. Maybe there is a marker if uh, if we go to the right one. There's no other galaxy here. It's just these ones. Nothing here either. Let's just quick check them all and this way we'll be able to tell if there's a marker or not saying where to go otherwise I guess we just gotta blindly explore all these planets journal say where where is the find liara sasoni explore the uncharted worlds of the artemis tau cluster yeah so we just have to blindly explore all the planets that's crazy well, i guess we'll start with like the one the cursor defaults to can't land on this planet. Well... Or this one either. What the heck, man? This is weird. Commander, I'm picking up a signal from the planet's surface. It looks like an automated distress beacon. Oh, here we go. Land. Okay. Maybe we found it. I really should probably get a guide at this point. 
Uh, Rex in effect. I don't know why the X button is always weird to me. So, we have a distress signal, debris. Debris. Let's go check out the Debris. Yep, yep, yep. What's your guys' favorite type of beer? Do you like porters or lagers or IPAs? Or do you not really care and you just, you just drink to get drunk? It's like a whole culture to get involved in all that beer stuff. Well, here's the debris. Old Debris. Salvage. In manual by hands. Bang it, I grazed the wrong button. Abby Abby. Yay, we got stuff. Now that we did that, we could go to the anomaly. Anomaly. Well, I guess we should check out the distress signal first, but if I were to gather, the distress signal is probably nothing, and the anomaly is probably what we need to investigate. Lithium deposit? Let me get my little Starfield gun out. Survey mineral. Whoa, that was a lot of credits. Area secured. Yeah, I know the area is secured. Get in the tank. You dope. Sun is pretty cool. I wonder what space people, astronauts as they're called, would uh, talk about on their journeys. I also wonder what doing it in zero G's feels like. That's probably a thrill. This 
looks like Titania from Star Fox. Whoa! Thrasher Maul, get out of here! Boss. Oh, he's got a smidgen left. Look out. Tank controls don't fail me now. Scratch one boat. That was a lot of credits and some decent experience, too. And, well, isn't that so nice? Now, what is this all about? My way! Alliance soldiers. Looks like they were lured here by the distress beacon. Looks like these men were under Admiral Kahoku's command. Do you want to know what happened here? Who's Admiral Kahoku? Well, that was nothing. Hardly worth the fight. Not done yet though. We gotta check out the anomaly now. This is neat, but you can also see how it's padding out. Like you go to find one little piece of debris before the next big, like, open-world exploration thing. Captain Milan's identification tag. Possible to know. Got some credits for that. Did that see what I mean? That was the anomaly? Was just a dead body? What is there to do on this place? Do we have to find all the other things? Like that lithium deposit wasn't mapped until we got close to it. Maybe over here there's something. Probably another Thresher Maw. It's just wide open space. Nope, it's just a wide open space. Well, what the heck, man? I guess we're done here, because I'm not exploring everything. Every inch of the nothing. That's not what I thought. Yeah, that didn't update. It still says explore that cluster. Did we get... 
Missing survey team. We had to have just picked up a side quest from all that, right? I don't know. Survey. Large concentration of hydrogen. Oh, so we can't land on every planet. Wait, maybe this isn't as huge of an ordeal as it seems. If, yeah, all we could do is survey stuff. Wait, there was an unknown thingy. Can't do anything with it. Alright, that's Sparta. I guess on to Macadon. If there's only one landable planet, or explorable planet, I guess is a better way of putting it. Oh, this is this is one of them. Well, we should probably check the other ones first then to see if that's true. Yeah, survey. Ratings. Signal from an ancient beacon. Padovig. Can't even do anything here but look at it. Well, what's the point? It's like all the dumb planets in Starfield. Yeah, so it looks like... Shargila is the one. Level 1 pressure hazard. Okay, where the heck are we going on this place? Let's take a look. We got debris again. Yeah, like I said, it's, it's kind of neat, but it's it's just padding out in a way. But like when it actually is a big on foot section, it's fun. I don't know how I feel about this tank stuff though. Like all these things that I don't understand. They seem like add-ons to stuff. Stronghold or anomaly. I guess we should check out the anomaly because it could just be a dead body again. You know what I haven't had in a while? Fettuccine Alfredo with broccoli and chicken and stuff. That sounds pretty good. I wonder how hot sauce would be with that. I got that Gringo Bandito hot sauce that Dexter Holland of The Offspring makes. Or like invented and now has other people make for him. And it's pretty good, so I'm in that mode where I'm putting hot sauce on random stuff to see how it tastes. I 
There's another mineral deposit on the right there. More writings. Yeah. It's kind of stale gameplay in a way, but it's still neat. Like, I don't hate it. Maybe if you were, like, speedrunning this, you would just rush the stronghold anyway. Or maybe this is an optional planet entirely. And... You would ignore it. A red sun rises. Blood has been shed this night. You found a pile of dung. Oh, it's thorium. Okay. Worth 760 credits. That's good. We need money so we can actually buy stuff at the shops. All right. So now we need to go to the stronghold, which sounds scary. Come on, tank. I don't know how I would feel about super spicy hot sauce, but I like the flavorful ones. Ones that have just enough kick to them to be tasty, but they don't overdo it. And that's what this gringo bandito stuff is like. Oh, what the heck? Snipers? Yeah. What can you do against a tank? That's a satisfying noise, the gun on the tank. Level up. Yeah, see, the gunfights are cool, because you get experience and money super fast. Alright, what do we got here? What do we got? Spectre training. Assault rifles we can max out. Combat armor, unlock first aid. Equip heavy armor. We do want a different outfit. Yeah, work on the armor. This guy, it doesn't really matter. Equip heavy armor, here we go. Let's get his battle master thing up there. There we go. And she, we know, is our electronics decryption person. go we got to work on her armor next Heading out. all 
Ah, what new madness awaits us in here? Oh, so much for crouching, that did nothing. Jeez, I thought that was Rex. They strafe around really strangely. Go, go, go. It's like Metroid music, Metroid Prime wobbly sounds going on in the background. Three shotgun stuff. Hey, level three armor. Try, Bob. All targets down. Hard decryption, all right. It's not that hard to press buttons in sequence. If you could see them all in advance, it'd be easier. Anna Dantius, an important ambassador on the Citadel, our sisters, you should report and confront Nasana with this. Oh, we got a side quest. Lots of credits there. We got some good supplies. What's this? Yeah. Hurricane 3 shotgun. Oh, wow, the Scimitar 3 shotgun, though. That one's really good compared to what we got. Or no. Storm 3, even. Now, the armor is what I'm... We, we picked up something that intrigued me. Phoenix 3. Oh, there it is. That one's way better. Heavy armor, though. Oh, it's that white and pink outfit. I remember that from when I was in California. I saw... I don't think I was playing, but I saw it.
It's gonna be hard to beat heavy armor. Got nothing for these other guys. Although the Omni tool. Oh, wait, that's her old Omni tool. Yeah, the one, the Savant 5 is the good one. Want her to keep that. We could give her a better rifle. Whoops. Well, wait. We could have a better rifle. The Reaper 3? See, this is why I, I planned on doing that off screen because it was. It, you see how time consuming it is to read all those numbers and make sense of it. Ooh, we got pretty armor on. Mostly because the underwear is on the outside of the plastic. Alright. Well, that was pointless. But not really. We got some good stuff. It just was not the main objective. So... What else was there over here? Did we check? I can't remember. Pad of Vig sounds familiar. Yeah, we checked that already. Bargaloos, we checked. So we're done with that. On to Athens in the Artemis Tau sector. Maybe this is where the lady is that we gotta find. Salamis. Nausicaa. Sounds like nausea. Wow, none of these are landable. There's not one single explorable planet on this cluster. Hey, that makes our job easier though, really. So no complaints. Athens is stupid. Let's go to this one. Did I actually randomly guess this right and check out all the planets except for the one that the person's on? Theorem land. Well, it can only be here. That's it for the Artemis Tau sec sector. This is different. It's a maze. That leads to a refinery and all kinds of canyons. Commander, I'm picking up some strange readings. Really strange, like off the damn charts. 
It looks like it's coming from an underground complex a few clicks away from the drop zone. All right, Seth Green. I don't know, that guy sounds like Seth Green to me sometimes. Not entirely, but sort of. Controls have kind of confused me. That's a dead end. What direction? Yeah, we're at the dead end, so let's just put a flag where we gotta go. Oh, I see it. It's just a matter of getting the tank controls to respond. I feel like Austin Powers right now. There we go. Rocket comes flying in, man. Man, imagine like an action replay code where your guns are as strong as the tank. Rifle four, medium armor four. I 
I think that gate was just to come in here. We we went around anyway. So in other words, it was pointless. Surely there's got to be more gate controls or something. Yeah, this is a gate, is it not? There's another target somewhere hiding in the building. Oh, this is a dead end. Wait, what was that? Oh, it was just Rex. I saw Erdnot quickly pop up on screen and I was like, what the heck was that? That's a new path. The underwear's on the outside. Yeah, that's the way we came in. I think it's this gate over here. Oh, that was just the refinery? Holy crap. We've been going for a while, too. This might be a longer episode. You got nothing, chumps. You got nothing. Forgot we leveled up. Um. Hmm. Specter training. We haven't done anything on. Increase the damage and duration of all your powers. Health by five. Ooh. Unity. She needs armor. Well, that thing's huge. Death Colossus. Six hundred twenty two experience for that guy. See, I like games that still give you experience, like an RPG, but it's live action and, like, the action doesn't come to a halt. 
for turn-based battles and stuff. That's why I'm having such a hard time getting into Mario RPG again. There's a fork. Oh, it's to the left. The right looked more passable. What? Two little guys in a tunnel. There's an elevator, we're coming up to something. Whoa, Debris. Gonna go on foot. There's nothing for it, Mr. Frodo. Oh wow, this is a long way to a mining camp. The music's doing something though, so maybe we're doing the right thing. I just can't help but wonder if there was a way to bring the tank. Gotta snipe that guy. Beautiful. with you shot a rock see what I mean this is kind of cool like all the uh, on foot battle stuff Just driving around that tanks a little boring This was the snapshot for the planet itself when we were examining it on the galaxy screen. What the heck is that thing? We gotta fight one of these massive things on foot. Don't just stand there, Collie. He 
Did she die? Oh, crap. That's not permanent, though, I don't think. Okay, that grenade did nothing. I expect the grenades to be better than they are. wasn't. Yeah, I'll just keep doing this. We'll have them in no time. Oh, come on. That should have done it. All right. Craziness. How do we revive her? Down. Wait, it's a press Y to use medi gels and stuff, right? All patched up. That didn't do anything. Powers? Is there a way to revive people? No. Oh, she's up. I guess we got the last guy, so she's back on... All right. Oh, there's a ramp. Sitting here walking into the thing on the mini-map like it's gonna be an elevator, but it's up here. What is this madness? again. Let's get our assault rifle maxed out. She could really use the armor boost. 
Although it was her own fault for standing in front of the thing like a doe. So, you get dental insurance, vision insurance. What other stuff do you talk about in the elevator? You notice how elevators make you scan your card nowadays? You can't just press the button if you don't have a key card. We found her, finally. Can you hear me out there? I'm trapped, I need help. Liara Tassoni, I presume? Thank the goddess. I did not think anyone would come looking for me. Listen, this thing I'm in is a Prothean security device. I cannot move, so I need you to get me out of it, all right? There's some kind of repulsion field in the way. It's a Prothean barrier curtain. I knew it would keep me safe from the Geth. When I turned it on, I must have hit something I wasn't supposed to. I was trapped in here. You must get me out, please. Hmm. We'll find some way to help you. There is a control in here that should deactivate this thing. You'll have to find some way past the barrier curtain. That's the tricky part. The defenses cannot be shut off from the outside. I don't know how you'll get in here. Be careful. There is a Krogan with the Geth. They have been trying different ways to get past the barrier. Shotgun four, assault rifle four.
Yeah, man, look at that damage increase with the assault rifle four. Who cares about the uh, the heat sink decrease? Can give this guy a better rifle now too. There we go. They have better weapons. These lancers are no good anymore. So we can mark them as junk. This guy has a shotgun statistic, so maybe giving him a good shotgun is worth our time. There we go. Fumbling with the inventory. I know I said I would do it off screen, but I kind of want the better weapons now for whatever's coming up. That's a really good pistol. Hmm. What the heck do we do? Mining laser controls. Enter code. Oh. I guessed right, I guess. After I figured out the first bit of the sequence. the barrier we blasted through with the mining laser of course yes that makes sense please get me out of here before more geth arrive that button over there should shut down this containment field not so fast Shepard you sure she's on our side her mother's working with Sarah I am NOT my mother I don't even I don't know why Benezia joined Saren I don't want anything to do with that Turian bastard if she was with Saren, the Geth wouldn't be trying to kill her. Uh. Any idea how we get out of this place? There is an elevator back in the center of the tower. At least I, I think it's an elevator. It should take us out of here. Come on! I, I still cannot believe all this. Why would the Geth come after me? Do you think Benezia's involved? Seren's looking for the conduit. You're a Prothean expert. He probably wants you to help him find it. The conduit? But I don't know... What the hell was that? These ruins are not stable. That mining laser must have triggered a seismic event. We have to hurry. The whole place is caving in. Joker, get the Normandy airborne and lock in on my signal. On the double, mister. Aye, aye, Commander. Secure and away. ETA, eight minutes. 
He needs to move faster. If I die in here, I'll kill him. <laughs> Rex. Chunky guy want. Surrender. Or don't. That would be more fun. In case you didn't notice, this place is falling apart. Exhilarating, isn't it? Thanks for getting rid of those energy fields for us. Hand the doctor over. Whatever it is you want, you are not getting it from me. I'm not gonna give her up. She'll stay with us, thanks. Not an option. Saren wants her, and he always gets what he wants. Kill him. Spare the Asari if you can. Not, doesn't matter. Why do my guns automatically switch themselves? I'm glad we didn't have to manually do that. Too close, Commander. Ten more seconds we would have been swimming in molten sulfur. The Normandy isn't equipped to land in exploding volcanoes. They tend to fry our sensors and melt our hull. Just for future reference. We almost died out there and your pilot is making jokes? It's a coping mechanism. You'll get used to it. I see. It must be a human thing. I don't have a lot of experience dealing with your species, Commander. But I am grateful to you. You saved my life back there, and not just from the volcano. Those geth would have killed me or dragged me off to Saren. What did Saren want with you? Do you know something about the conduit? Only that it was somehow connected to the Prothean extinction. That is my real area of expertise. I have spent the past 50 years trying to figure out what happened to them. Did your research turn up anything interesting? What is interesting is what I did not turn up. There is remarkably little archaeological evidence of the Protheans, and even less that might explain why they disappeared. It is almost as if someone did not want the mystery solved. It is like someone came along after the Protheans were gone and cleansed the galaxy of clues. But here is the incredible part. According to my findings, the Protheans were not the first galactic civilization to mysteriously vanish. This cycle began long before them. What cycle? What are you talking about? The galaxy is built on a cycle of extinction. Each time a great civilization rises up, it is suddenly and violently cast down. Only ruins survive. The Protheans rose up from a single world until their empire spanned the entire galaxy. Yet even they climbed to the top on the remains of those who came before. Their greatest achievements, the mass relays and the citadel, are based on the technology of those who came before them. And then, like all the other forgotten civilizations throughout galactic history, the Protheans disappeared. I have dedicated my life to figuring out why. 
They were wiped out by a race of sentient machines, the Reapers. The... the Reapers? But I have never heard of... How do you know this? What the evidence beacon, do you have? man! There was a damaged Prothean beacon on Eden Prime. It burned a vision into my brain. I'm still trying to sort out what it all means. Visions? Yes, that makes sense. The beacons were designed to transmit information directly into the mind of the user. Finding one that still works is extremely rare. No wonder the Geth attacked Eden Prime. The chance to acquire a working beacon, even a badly damaged one, is worth almost any risk. But the beacons were only programmed to interact with Prothean physiology. Whatever information you received would have been confused, unclear. I am amazed you were able to make sense of it at all. A lesser mind would have been utterly destroyed by the process. You must be remarkably strong-willed, Commander. This isn't helping us find Saren, or the Conduit. Of course, you're right. I am sorry, my scientific curiosity got the better of me. Unfortunately, I do not have any information that could help you find the Conduit, or Saren. You could still help. I don't know why Saren wanted you out of the picture, but I think we'll be a lot better off if we bring you along. Thank you, Commander. Saren might come after me again. I cannot think of anywhere safer than here on your ship. And my knowledge of the Protheans might be useful later on. And her bionics will come in handy when the fighting starts. Good to have you on the team, Liara. Thank you, Commander. I am very grateful. Oh, I am afraid I am feeling a bit lightheaded. When was the last time you ate? Or slept? Dr. Chakwa should take a look at you. It is probably just mental exhaustion, coupled with the shock of discovering the Protheans' true fate. I need some time to process all this. Still, it could not hurt to be examined by a medical professional. It will give me the chance to think things over. Are we finished here, Commander? Go see the doctor. The rest of you, dismissed. Mission reports are filed, Commander. You want me to patch you through to the Council? Patch him through, Joker. Setting up the link now, Commander. We've received your report, Commander. I understand Dr. Tassoni is on the Normandy. I assume you're taking the necessary security precautions. Liara is on our side. The Geth were trying to kill her. Benezia would never allow Saren to kill her daughter. Maybe she doesn't know. Or maybe we don't know her. We never expected she could become a traitor. At least the mission was a success. Apart from the utter destruction of a major Prothean ruin. Was that really necessary, Shepard? I don't care. We almost died in there. The Geth were everywhere. Of course, Commander. The mission must always take priority. Good luck, Commander. Remember, we are all counting on you. Alright, that was a lot of dialogue to get through, and this is a really long episode. Holy crap. Okay, well, let's end things off then. Whatever it is that we gotta do next. I guess go to the other story points. So thanks for watching, you guys, and I'll see you later. Take care.